You got a lot of balls, boy. Yeah. <laughs> hey, everybody. This is Daniel, and that is actually a tub of Canada right balls. Um, I was actually putting stuff up, and I noticed uh, on some of these burna. Well, I, on all these now that I actually got to looking, uh, on these burna kinetic balls, uh, it, it caught my eye. The, uh, one of these little flat places here caught my eye, uh, and I was like, huh, because I. Uh, well, let me tell you the story first. Um, saw a video the other day. And uh, the guys were, you know, looking at the flat places on the balls, and uh, they theorized that they had just been sitting in the mags together, and that's what had happened. Um, and the reason that story is significant is because I know for a fact that none of these have been in a magazine. Uh, none of these have been in the in the marker or anything. Uh, these are brand new, and um, if if you look. Well, there, right off the bat, you've got the, uh, got the dot, and look at that. Okay, so there's one, and we'll peek at this one real quick. Ooh. See, I hadn't even, honestly, I hadn't even been noticing that until just like in the video. I'd, I'd saw, seen the lines, but that's actually even worse. Um, but I'd seen the, the lines on a few of them, and the, you know, the flat spot. Um, which is on, you know, everyone. Now, is that flat spot uh, going to make a big difference? Uh, who knows? But uh, I, I do know for a fact between between these two balls and anything uh, that I have um, fired them out of, uh, so far the uh, Canada right balls have had a um, higher um, energy. Um, uh, not th these are lighter, so uh, higher uh, higher feet per second out of the burners. But when you uh, factor in the weight and everything, and uh, actually get your um, joules or your foot pounds or whatever uh, the Canada right balls are doing better um, part of that you know the, the weight it's more ideal weight and I think uh, a big chunk of that uh, also is uh, this finish I mean and, and these are not the glazed glassy you know the the 9.9 .9 gram round ball right balls these are these are the light you know like four gram ones um, so, so these, you know, these are slick, and I mean nice. I mean, you you don't look at one of these and see those kind of imperfections. You just don't see it. I mean, these are slick. And, I mean, look at the the sheen on that. And I, you know, it's a different color, whatever. But still, I mean, you can tell the, the, these are polished. Okay, those are not. Um, so you you know, weight weight's more ideal. Uh, but then, you know, the, the actual, uh, drag is cut down, uh, the drag is cut down and then, uh, granted it's a 68 caliber plastic ball. So you're not doing like match grade shooting with it anyway. So, you know, accuracy, whatever, but still it, it's going to account for something. It is absolutely, um, w whether it's enough to measure or not, who knows, but you know, when you've got a a ball that is perfectly round, perfectly polished, versus a ball that is not as polished, going to give you more drag in the barrel, uh, especially firing out of a uh, firing out of a non-rifled barrel. So then it, you know, it, it, and I'm not going to get all the physics and all that, but it's, it makes it even worse in uh, you know one like this. So anyway, um, and then you know, on top of it, you have imperfections that could you know, potentially cause, um, not issues necessarily, but could potentially decrease your accuracy. Or, you know, in some cases, I guess, maybe you could do something. I don't know. It, it, it'd be a big stretch for, for you know, I, I don't think there's probably anything, uh, an imperfection bad enough on the burn balls to actually cause any kind of malfunction in the marker. But still, I mean, come on. You know, the quality... Yeah, you know, and actually, I've got some of the the, the new Burna, the biodegradable ones or whatever, supposed to be coming. I've had them ordered for a long time, but um, so I'm not expecting a whole lot out of those either. But I feel only fair to you know try to test them since I do have a Burna and whatever. But anyway, I just you know numbers and all that jazz aside, just the quality. Um, I just I, I really I'm very very pleased with these. Very, very pleased with the company, actually. Uh, I am huge on customer service. Uh, Mikey does it right. Um, he's got a customer for life. So 
uh, check them out. Canada Riot Balls. Very, very good quality. Um, awesome. So, peace.